Hi, this is Richard Byrne at freetechforteachers.com. In this video, I want to show you how you can add a Creative Commons licensed image search tool to your classroom blog. And to do this, we're going to use Photos for Class, which you can find at photosforclass.com. Photos for Class provides a way to search for Creative Commons licensed images. The nice thing about everything from Photos for Class is that it comes with the attribution information your students will need when they download a picture and reuse it in another project. Uh, to take a look at what that would look like, let's say we would have the Photos for Class here and test out the search tool. I'll look for a picture of a puppy. And we have lots of puppy pictures here. Let's go ahead and say I want to use this puppy picture. Or I want to use this puppy picture. Let's, let's use this one. And we'll download that. And the neat thing is when this downloads and I open it up, there's all the attribution information that I'm going to need. Now let's go back and look at how we add this tool to our website. So Photos for Class offers two formats, a small format or a small display and a big display for your search box. We'll use a small display for this example. All you need to do is highlight the code. And now I'm going to go over to my blogger blog. Let's say I'm using blogger for my classroom blog. And we'll go down to our option for layout. And now let's select add a gadget. And the gadget we're going to add is called HTML slash JavaScript. Just click the plus symbol, paste in that code that we got over on Photos for Class. If we want to title the widget, we can. We can say image search. Let's save it and save the arrangement. Now let's go ahead and see what that blog is going to look like when it loads. And now we have our Photos for Class image search tool directly in the blog. Let's go look for that puppy picture again. And there it is. There's all of our puppy pictures. So for more tips and tricks like this, check out freetechforteachers.com.